Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and um, to answer a very quick question that actually was uh, released this morning by a couple of viewers. Uh, according to, of course, they noticed that YouTube and Gmail was down. And the question is simple, is why do these services that are so huge go down and why specifically do they go down for everybody around the world at the same time when they could just go down for a specific area. And this has to do with the interconnections between every service of these big companies like Google. So if you uh, have not been living under a rock, or if you use your computer a lot, you have probably noticed that the uh, services of Google, Gmail, YouTube, and pretty much everything that has to do with Google was down. There were exceptions like uh, Google Maps didn't go down, for example. Now, um, one of the things that, of course, was asked is why do they go down? What could have happened? So, of course, Google rarely mentions why there is a problem, what happened for that problem to be there. But one thing that uh, is often the case is human error. Um, you know, they come constantly update servers, they constantly add servers, they constantly reprogram certain services to um, add new features or change features or even remove features. And of course, all of that is done by humans. All of that is rerouted by humans. And a simple uh, mistype, a simple little, you know, character that you changed without actually knowing about it can actually bring down these services. It's over the years, it's been um, shown that, you know, it doesn't take much to actually bring down a whole network. So, you know, it could be human error. It could be uh, programming that didn't go right and uh, took offline everything. It could be, of course, uh, it does happen that it sometimes is a, a major problem with, you know, equipment, hardware, that f a failure of a, some, you know, crucial hardware that uh, does that. Another uh, thing that happens, but here this doesn't seem to be the case, is a DDoS or denial, distributed denial of service attacks. But these rarely cause the type of problem we've seen this morning. They usually will actually re prevent you from going to the site. Or they will, you, know, you won't have access at all. Today it really seems to be, um, when I look, the more I look about the reports and what exactly, who was affected and what was happening, it is centered and seems to be centered around the login problem. It seems that your accounts couldn't be seen anymore. They couldn't find them. So, um, you know, there's a, a big possibility that it was more of a human error in programming somewhere on their own big networks. And the reason why it's worldwide all the time is very simple, is that it actually is interconnected. Google is interconnected around the world with everything, all of its services. So if you bring down something major, you bring down everything because everything is kind of centralized. You know, it's um, interesting because the internet was built upon the fact that there were redundant, um, you know, branches where you could uh, connect differently. You connect from a different. Um, you know, routing, if you want, when there was a problem. But the problem today is that a lot of the services that are done on the internet actually aren't redundant, that they have one way of connecting. And if something fails, it's, it just doesn't connect in any other way. And uh, that is one of the major problems. So, you know, something happens, everything goes down. So, of course, if we do learn, we uh, I'll post a video talking about it. But the major cause, usually, um, and, and it's like nine times out of ten, a misconfigured uh, server somewhere, a misconfigured routing table that just doesn't, you know, send to the right place when you actually ask for a service, for example. So they probably, they possibly have updated something and uh, there was an, uh, a mistake in the code, or there was an error in the code, and it just brought down everything. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.